Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to add a location to your experience. Adding a location is very easy and what it does is it only allows the experience to be opened when you're at a specific GPS location. So I have an experience here that's part of a larger scavenger hunt. All I'm going to do is publish the experience and then we'll go into the advanced section of the publish menu. Now what we want to do is make our experience part of a group and this is going to open up the GPS options for us. So we'll click on part of group and then you'll notice that group has opened up here on the left hand side. Let's go ahead and click on that and you can select a group if you've already created a group of experiences. But what we're going to do is click on new to create a new group. All you have to do is give your group a name. So we'll call this My Scavenger Hunt and we'll give it a description. Find all of the dancing gifts and collect pizza toppings. I don't know, something silly, doesn't matter. You just have to give it a short description. Once you're ready, all you do is click on Create Group. And now we have a group. Inside of the group menu, you'll notice that we have different options here set up, allowing repeat interactions and requiring proximity. By having allow repeat interactions turned on, it means that you're allowing the user to go through the experience multiple times. If you want them to only go through the experience once, you're going to turn this off. I'm going to leave that on for now. And then we're going to click on require proximity and this is going to activate our GPS location. So require proximity. Now when you turn this on, now a locations menu has appeared and you can add locations via iBeacons that you've registered via the Metaverse mobile app or GPS locations. We're going to be talking about GPS locations in this video. So let's go ahead and click on add GPS location and then you'll notice that a map has appeared on our screen. Now you can add the GPS location in three ways. You can click and drag the location and this is mainly used for fine tuning. At the bottom left you can click on the pencil icon and add the exact GPS locations. Now keep in mind these are the decimal value GPS locations. And then at the top right what I like to do is use the search bar. So I'm going to type in Balboa Park in San Diego. It's a famous park in San Diego. And then I'm going to zoom in a little bit and just drag the map around to get it exactly where I want it to be. So I'll put it right here in front of this fountain. Once you're ready to confirm your location, just click on select here and you'll see that the location has been added. Now locations are available as soon as you're within a 30 meter radius of that location. So if they're in the area but they're not within 30 meters of the location, then they're not going to be able to open up the experience. Finally, all we have to do to confirm our changes is click on publish. And great, we've now added a GPS location to our experience. I hope you learned something about adding locations to experiences in this video, and I will see you next time.